I have a love-hate relationship with Benchy because they always come out either perfect or far from it. So today, we're taking out some anger and blowing them up. I've got small firecrackers working all the way up to this M4000 with 4,000 firecrackers in it. And we're gonna blow up our biggest Benchy yet. So stick around, let's work our way through these. But first, our sponsor, PCBWay. If you need any 3D printing, CNC machining, custom PCBs or PCB assembly, they can help you out. Check out their site, upload your design, and get it in a few days. Check out my link in the description below for $5 off your first order. Let's blow up some Benchies. The first and smallest is the Silver Salute Select. It has the biggest bang per Benchy ratio. And first, we're gonna just light one without a Benchy to see what it looks like. Stick around, they get bigger from here. I did not expect them to blow up like that. And next up is even bigger M98. The M98 is a slightly bigger bang than the Silver Salute, but let's see what kind of damage we can do with a slightly bigger Benchy. Not bad, not as messy thanks to the extra plastic, but they still went flying. The legal limit is 50 milligrams of flash powder per firecracker, so as we get to bigger firecrackers, they are going to pack more of them in a single package. Let's see how Benchy holds up.
Benchy held up really well against the seismic wave considering it's a one wall, almost no wind fill Benchy. But let's see how it holds up against the cannonball, which explodes open and launches more firecrackers. I did have to cut a bigger hole in the cabin just to fit these. Underwhelming, but I didn't realize it would launch the firecrackers out of Benchy, so let's move on to the big one. The big one, the M4000, has 4,000 firecrackers wrapped up inside. You're supposed to unwrap it, lay it out, light the fuse, and it slowly goes through them all. Or you find the fuse and you just light it in its container, which is what we're going to do using my Cobra 3 Max. I had to print this in three parts and glue it together. Let's see how it holds up. I'm hoping this thing goes up. Tufts on the fire to make sure nothing else is in there, but it looks like I should have taken off all the plastic before lighting this. Benchy held up great, more of like a fire breathing Benchy to me. All right, well, that's the only one I had. Like and subscribe if you liked what I did here, and maybe I'll do some more destruction instead of creation. I'll see you in the next one.